everybody, I thought we could just do a quick wee unboxing of Titan Master Brawn that I picked up the other day. I went back into my Toys R Us that had uh, like recently reopened after getting refade and stuff, and they had like a wee selection of uh, Titans Return stuff. They had like Wave 3 Deluxes, I want to say, and Wave 2 Titan Masters. I really wanted Wave 3 Titan Masters, I really want Fangry, but... They had Bronn, who I rather like foolishly didn't pick up when I picked up Ape Face and Sky Tread. So, you know, I snapped him up and here we are. So, hey, let's crack into him. Doo -doo. This is my first time. I'll probably not talk over the cardboard, but this is my first time doing uh, an unboxing of these guys, I think. I meant. Every time I picked up a Wee Titan Master guy, I meant to do one. But then, you know. It got the better of me. The beast came upon me, and I had to just open them there and then and play with them. Because these guys are super, super fun, like, for their price point and what they are. Because they're, they're essentially little monoleg guys with, like, very little articulation and very little to do themselves. But actually, the secret is revealed with their vehicles, and they actually do have weirdly a lot to do. So, yeah. These guys were a must-get for myself. They are pretty yellow and green looking. I mean, like... Never a fan of Brawn. I mean, I never, I never saw the original V1 cartoon until like way later, and then I was never into like the memes or the jokes about him being like, like you know how like he fights Soundwave quite a lot. Apparently, never got that. Never. All I knew of Brawn was that he got killed to death in the film. I think you know, killed to death. I think. Anyway, who do oh. Oh yeah, I, it, like I was, I wasn't concerned about how they were going to do his head, but I was, I was interested to see how they'd do his head. You know how he's like got the famous chrome dome type shape, but yeah, he's. He, I can forgive these little ear prongs; they don't offend me. The other reason, the other reason I wanted to pick him up is because he got a little um, legends body, and I'm not quite sure if Brawn fits inside Brawn, but I mean, he can drive Brawn, I think. And I totally, totally want to get in on that action. That is something that excites me quite greatly. Yeah, so I'm going to have lots of fun on the old Instagram, plugging this guy into other Titan Master bodies. I've only got one other Autobot, but I'm sure the Decepticons can accommodate him. He's, he, he's got a very characterful face. That is lovely. I wonder how... Yeah, he's, it looks hollow, but I'm pretty sure he like fills it out. So, does he go in like this? No. Like this. <laughs> yeah. Mm, probably best not to work this out on camera, but hey oh. The other reason I super wanted to get Brawn is that it comes with this Brum card. Do you remember Brum? I feel like it was a nineties thing. It might have been like a hangover from the eighties that we just saw in the nineties here in Scotland, but Brum was a hell of a show. Look at this. Oh my, he's in a little brum car. Is that the front of the car? Yes. So yeah, vroom. Vroom. Yes. Very, very excited about this one. Mm-hmm. Thumbs up. Thumbs. It's size comparison guff time! Here's Braun with his wave mates. And they look pretty cool together. They're like, nicely sized. His, his little um, Titan Master fits in to make a wee, wee wing shape. And I've got to say, I quite like the vehicle. It has, like, these four tread things, like a Taurus from uh, 40k. And I've always kind of liked how silly the Taurus is. So, I'm into this. It can also do other things, like, it, I think it folds out. And I don't know if this is meant to be, like, a uh, motorbike off-road tread thing, but you can do it like that, and then I, it, it looks quite a lot more like a, a battleship to me, like a space battleship, but I don't know, probably show you the sign of the Autobot insignia that's upside down. You can have it this way as well, you know, this is an all-encompassing video, you know, there's going to be multiple, multiple modes on display, for sure. But I, uh, this one also uh, goes into a gun mode, you can put his, uh, 
a little bit out there, and I think his Titan Master's come a wee bit wibbly. I'm not quite sure if I'm putting it into the, like, the stock in there correctly, or if, you know, it's just a bit loose, but we'll, we'll figure that out in time. So yeah, you can have the bigger guys hold it like a gun, because that is also one of the secret, well not the secret things, but one of the selling points of the line. And this price point figures is that you can turn them into guns. And this one looked pretty interesting because it's got like a peg there, but it keeps pushing back up when I push on it. So I'm gonna gonna see if I can get it actually in someone's hand now. Hmm, that's concerning. Bear with me. Yes, you beard with me. We have gun mode, and it looks pretty spiffy, I have to say. Might be one of my favourites of the gun modes, because the gun mode on the little Titan Master vehicles is one of the weaker points, occasionally. It's a wee bit of a disappointment. I mean, it's great that it's there. It's great that it's a third thing that they can do. You know, just cram more, like, bang for your buck into that, what, five or six bucks do they are going for, but... <sighs> yes, here is Highbrow, and he's holding bronze vehicle with brawn in him as a gun, which you can see pretty much works. Look, we'll do some panning shots. Wow. Doo -doo. Yeah, I like it. It's definitely a mode. Oh my god, guys, bronze head looks cracking. Like, look at that face. Look at the sculpt, look at the lines, look at the eyes, oh my god, that's silver. He also looks like he's no good for you, like, like look at that, look at that smirk, that derision he has on his face. He might be one of my favourite heads in the Titan Masters line that I've played with. I mean, Ape Face is a belter, and I quite like the genericism of Skytread, but Bronn, he, he looks like a guy, he looks like a person, he looks like a, like a macho man that's like, ah oh, man, I'm gonna break you, you know, with this body that I've just acquired, but, that said, very, very spiffy looking. Let's try more modes! If there's one negative I could say about Braun is that he's a wee bit bland. Like, he's one of those guys that falls victim to the entire paint loss that happened between waves, and I've been on record as saying that I really don't mind that because they're so small, and they, they do get character across with just, you know, the coloured plastics that they have. But his head is so amazingly silver that, like, if he had a wee matching noggin on his actual, like, Titan Master head, that would have been perfect. That would have been the cherry on the cake. Also, here he is with Highbrow, or whatever Highbrow's Titan Master is called. I don't know what that is. Zort? Um, Grax? These are words. No, I think Skull Cruncher's one's Grax. Anyway, Braun... Looks cool. I like him. So here we have Brum in full... Well, Brum. Here we have Brawn in full Brum mode. He's just so Brum that he takes over the Brawn persona, you know? This is great. This vehicle. This mode right here. Really good. Far better than uh, Nightbeat's little tank, which... I didn't think I'd be saying, you know, when Titan's Return was announced, and these were one of the, Night Beats was one of the first uh, picks out, if I recall correctly, and I was super, super excited to get a drill tank, and a wee mini drill tank at that, that did other things, and then I got it, and Night Beat was a wee bit, I don't know, lackluster is probably the word, I, I, I didn't enjoy Night Beat as much as I thought, but Rum, on the other hand, Brum Brawn, Brawn Brum, very fun, lots of stuff to do here, love the green, love the yellow, love the treads, they're triangles, they're triangles, tri like what is going on? Also you can like flip these forward and you can put it into like half gun, half tractor motorbike mode, you know, for agricultural warfare, yeah. I think that's all the modes. I think I've forgotten to show the bike one, but I can't be bothered filling it around anymore. I've I've had my fun, you know. You know. Anyway, Braun. Bye, Braun. Secret snowmobile mode.